Hmm. Okay. Huh. Some kind of random ass battle going on, I guess. Sorry to start it right here, but uh for some reason none of that started when I was trying to record it, so it just sorta It just sorta just stopped on me and just said, heh, no. So now I'm essentially in the desert, you know, just uh trying to meet up with the king of Aeroglyph because that's where he agreed to meet in this little area, so I gotta meet up with him in here. So let's do that. And uh I will just fast forward through the dungeon after I get my... I don't even care about the money at this point, I'm just going to go straight to it. So let's go do it, guys. Okay, door open. I guess that's all three that I needed. And, peculiar enough, there's a save point. You know what that means? I'm about to save it and get into it. But guess what? I just made an item for 450 attack though. Let me just, let me just, let me see this real quick. 450. I just sent, I just made that. Like, I want that for this dude. I want that for him, but I only made a room blaze. So I want something better than that though. Like, shit. Shit. Oh god. If I can make something like that for him, 500 attack, I'm taking 3,000 damage per hit. I'm good. He's here. Thank you for coming, Romeria. It's been a long time. Yes. Yes, it has been, Arze. I am so pleased to see you are well. Likewise, Romeria. You are as beautiful as ever. Huh. They must have had and a you thing. You have not changed one bit, I see. That's interesting. Why is he, that little boy even there? Like, come on. <laughs> but what took you so long? I was starting to fear that one of our hardliners had done something foolish. Don't play dumb with us. By that, I take it that something did happen. Please accept my deepest apologies. Those troublemakers had the impudence to suggest that we need not ally ourselves with Aquaria if we could stand up to the new enemy alone. They urged me to conquer Aquaria and take your new weapon for ourselves. A simple plan for simple minds. They do not understand the dire consequences of misjudging this new enemy's strength. We are facing a much stronger threat this time and cannot afford to exhaust our strength. Then you agree to our proposal? Yes, we have no other choice. Our military forces also sustained terrible losses in that recent attack. Out of the three brigades of Aeriglyph, only the Storm Brigade still has a captain. Woltar is the only one left. Okay. Hmm? What happened to Albel? I wonder if he was killed. But tell me, who is this enemy we face? I heard your agent's explanation the other day, but it made no sense to me. I felt the same way. Perhaps they can explain it to us again. Fast forward, fast forward. Okay, now I see. Hmm. I have to admit, I find it hard to believe. What about you, Romeria? I must believe, Arze. Lest both our countries be destroyed. Turning these outsiders over to this new enemy is another option, is it not? That might have been possible before. But now I am afraid it is no longer an option. Why is that? The enemy attacked the Shrine of Kadan. Kadan was attacked? Kadan has nothing to do with What the heck was that for? What the heck? Hence, there is but one thing left to try. Engage them on our own terms. Correct. We must unite the power of our nation's runological weapon and Aeriglyph's air dragon. You know it! This is no time to fret over national honor. That is correct. Time to get busy, baby! Alright, let us join forces. However, at present, having our air dragons carry your runological weapon will not be an easy task. Please explain. First, it is a matter of size. According to information obtained by our spies, your weapon would be too big to be carried by an air dragon. 
How about carrying it with more than one dragon? That too would be difficult. Uh, then what's the point of this alarm? Do not be so hasty, young man. The king said, at present. Huh? That's true, he did say at present. I said it's a matter of size. To carry a big weapon, we need a bigger air dragon. Where could we find such a beast? In the Urza Lava Caves, near a place you have already been. The Ugh, Mines, those big dragons that are I mean, to have dragon electricity. Of immense size dwells within the caverns there. So all we have to do is capture the critter? That is correct. However, mistaking him for a mere air dragon would be suicide. The Marquis, as the beast is known, is a creature of immense size and strength. Even Vox was unable to subdue him. Do not fear, Arze. I trust they will be capable. I do not doubt you feel that way. However, our trust is not so easily given. Then what do you propose we do? Did you not consent to joining forces? I only request that a representative of Eriglyph be included in their party. Then I shall withdraw my objections. A just proposal. But who would you have go? Woltar? No. I'll no, bail. Woltar is much too old. I do not have the heart to send him into the Urza Lava Caves. I was thinking of someone else. Why is else. my speakers, my headphones doing that? Making these static who sounds. Might that be? I was thinking about sending Albel. Albel? Do you object? I, for one, am quite fond of him. What do you think, Romeri? I consent. This Albel shall travel with the party. You do not mind. Do I mean, I thought he was dead, but okay, that's fine. I personally don't mind, but. It doesn't matter what we think. The problem's gonna be what Albel thinks. Then it is settled. Albel will be waiting for you in Eriglyph. You can meet him there. We understand. We will be expecting you. Can you just warp me there? Because I really don't feel like I running. Must ask that you take us to Paterni. Claire can escort us from there. Oh, and if that's the case. After that, you may head to Eriglyph. Your Majesty. Can we please, like, ah? We gotta run there again. Well, I guess it's one of those types of things where you just gotta. Keep moving. Why is there a floating crystal? What the frick? Why do I feel like this is where you fight Freya? You know, I, d I don't know why, but it, it just seems like this is where you fight her. I wish I could just teleport and warp, but this is really bugging me. You know, I gotta run all the way back. You know what? Skip. Oh, another cutscene. Claire, I'm leaving Her Majesty in your hands. Yes. Leave it to me. I do not believe it is a trap, but nevertheless, please be careful. Don't worry, Your Majesty. We'll be fine. It's just like Her Majesty said. Everything begins with trust. So it does. May Apris guide you in your path. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Apris will. I look forward to bringing you good news. And we look forward to your safe return. Too bad you don't have phones. It'd be so much easier with the phone, you know? I think I finally made it. Just took a little while to get here, but yeah. God, why does he walk like that? Okay, what is this? The Vaughn, Walter, 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 Coulter, Coulter, whatever. Alright, that was all about. They could have just say come through and I'd just be like, I bet, let me slide in. about some badass people though got sent by three people three uh brigades come after me ain't nothing happened now they're top warriors killed one of them wrecked the second one oh safe point you know what that means by the end of here guys i'll be enjoyed uh i did a hell of a lot of running around in this game i'm a bit upset that i couldn't get the very first part of the game you know first you know exposition in but sorry these things happen hope you guys have a good friday and you guys have a good weekend and i will see you guys later hopefully i stream if not 
I'll see you tomorrow. Um, much love, guys. Peace.